I'm a journalist. I'm a foreign correspondent. I write for um, international publications. Um, I make videos for international platforms as well. Uh, Ramadan means self-discipline. It means holding back um, even when I want to do stuff where <laughs> I know that nobody will hold me for it or beat me for it. But, you know, it just means telling myself uh, to be mentally disciplined. Yeah. Uh, the spirituality, uh, just being closer to Allah and feeling myself like in a higher realm. Yeah, that makes it special. By this time last year, I hadn't really gotten into it. I was doing it part time, but now I'm a full time freelancer and it requires a lot of traveling and a lot of hectic work. And I don't know how I'm going to do it. But I read something yesterday. They said life, uh, you have to adjust to life. Life doesn't adjust to you. So if I can do it in Ramadan, I can do it anytime. So yeah, looking forward to how I'll, I'll do it. I don't know how I'll balance it out yet, but I will. I have to. Um, so I always like my tajud period that's always my favorite time like just waking up three o'clock in the morning it just makes me feel closer to allah so that has always been even like outside of ramadan it's always been my favorite time so yeah i intend to make that very strong this time around yeah tajud it's always <laughs> so conflicting because when ramadan comes you know like this first um, days before it comes, you're a little bit scared, like, oh my God, it's coming. And then that middle period, you're like, yeah, I got this. And then <laughs> the last thing is like, oh my God, it's really going away, isn't it? <laughs> so it's always conflicting, like you don't want it to go, but then you're also looking forward to like, I cannot eat every time <laughs> and I have more strength, but yeah, so it's always conflicting for me. Like, I don't want it to go, but then it has to go, yeah. The meats and then of course, yeah, the clothes that I get, I always, it's always a, an opportunity for me to buy something new and nice but also just seeing people out on eat like you know especially the kids just the innocence and like the happiness that they bring to the streets it's just very exciting and you just want to hold on to that moment forever but you can't so just like the everybody going out and especially when they start to say the Allah Hakbar Allah Hakbar that's seven you know like it it feels like chills just run down my spine at that time. So yeah, that, that, that's really special for me. I am Jamila Lowell and I am super excited today because I have got this oh amazing guest in the house and I was a guest now with someone come and sent to the Suina. It's that yeah, girl again! <laughs> yeah. 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 Thank you so much oh, for coming on fire. Oh, you look great. Oh, oh. Thank you. You're all in red. <laughs> nice to have you in my kitchen. Thank you. So today we're gonna be making signature jollof. Yeah, my guests for you just help me small so that we can speed up this iftar. Mm -hmm. You won't eat my iftar. I know. Ah, for iftar, I'm, I'm here. <laughs> I will cook inside. I will inside the pot. Just and we'll be right back. <laughs> So what I'm going to start with first, I'm chicken is my veggies, so mm -hmm. tomato, seta, seta, rugu, albasa, kamayen, demo, kaseni for our mm -hmm. jollof fries. Okay. But what I'm going to do differently this time around is I'm going to boil them whole. As to, you know, you blend them before usually, but I'm going to boil them whole first before I blend them. Alright, so I'm just going to uh, just chop this up and then cook them. Okay. So, um, some onions too. I mm. like to clean up like when we're in the kitchen mm -hmm. so it just reduces the amount of time you like you clean up afterwards. Okay, after so you clean while you so cook, is that better? Cleaning while, yeah, clean it. It's not so easy but it's the best way to go. Especially during Ramadan, you know, you don't want to come back yeah, and so have a dirty too. kitchen it's and true. you are thinking, oh, how do I do this? Alright, so just gonna add the tarugu and zoo. So just a little bit of water to let the steam. Okay. I observe that they are steaming. Yes, so just a little bit that of water. That was steaming. Yes. We're done with this. So um, and let me clear up the kitchen. And then we'll go, we'll go on to marinate our chicken. We'll be grilling the chicken. Why do they call it marinade? Like, why do they call it marinade? Because you get to um, 
adding like your flavors. So mm -hmm. we'll have um, ginger garlic. This has been chopped already. Mm -hmm. and I'm gonna season with um, Maggi chicken and then you add some yaji and okay. some vegetable oil. So you marinate it, it helps it like absorb all of those flavors. Okay. And sometimes marinades also help meat, tenderize meat. So okay. you can do that overnight. Oh! Yes. Now we're going to add Maggi chicken, so you can help me with that, you girl. I will help you with the Maggi chicken. Okay. Maggi chicken, meet your brother in the bowl. All right, so to meet your brother, sprinkle on your brother, say, hey, brother. All right, so, all right, so, Yenza Musa Yaji. She looking at you, Yaji? Ha, so sorry. Okay, that's good. So she's a, we can say she's a real Ariwa girl. Musa, I'm going to get that and and then we'll mix this all in. So, okay, just a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna get that. And then I'm just gonna mix it all in. So, say you call me, say you call me, you call me. I'm gonna call me. I'm gonna call me. In fact, I'm gonna call me. I'm gonna call me. I'm rubbing the oil. I'm gonna call me. Okay, so this is done. All right, so she's ready for the I'm back to the style. Signature to love. Cheers. Send me to the IG. Okay, so my time here is cooked. Oh. Did you smell that? So I'm just gonna scoop this out and then we'll blend it. I don't know if Chigo will agree to blend this thing for me. But didn't tell me, okay, let me just help you. Oh, thank you. So I can go ahead and do the other thing. It's a nice game. I stylishly yes. asked. <laughs> this is done. Okay. So um, we're gonna blend this now. Because it already has some water, so uh -huh. it'll blend into a very smooth paste. You'll like the way it looks. Why did you give me a macaranta maggi? What is the number I'm going to blend it? It's actually a number two. Number two. Mm. Going to number two. Ooh. So the pot is hot already. Just a little bit of vegetable oil. Don't need so much oil. Just very little. So, so this is good. So Yanzu, um, say Albo Sazan Sai Yanzu. Okay. Okay, Chika, don't buy any, um, Wukacha, when you go back, but then you can jump back, I don't know what. All right, thank you. Oh, that came on to Shikin and now go ahead. All right. Just to give it a design issue, you know, you knock out like this, you know? Okay. Then, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Then, like I said, you know. All right. Hot. Whoa! Yeah, he's just crying on you. I'm just crying on you. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna add my bay leaves, just a couple leaves. Okay, so Yanzu, same as the but Thai meal. So don't buy any tomato in your ishi. I'm sure you want to Thai meal, na? Oh, and the aroma is. And we didn't have to watch it boil. It's you didn't have actually to, ready to go. In fact, that thing's like label. Okay, we'll have to be careful here. Let me get the lid on one side. So that when we're dropping the other things, we won't get splashes of our tomatoes. So yeah, this is our maggi chicken emu. So you can help me with one of this. Okay. Yeah, we'll add one more. I unwrap it. Let's unwrap it and we will stylishly crumble our maggi chicken into a signature jollof phase. We'll give yourself you heard that. <laughs> yes. So I give this a quick stir. Okay. okay. And then we'll let this sit for a while. Check it also and see that when kitchen cap on me. Alright, while she does that, I'm gonna clear up my kitchen. That's the best part. <laughs> oh, thank you. Well done. I'm a good washer. Yes, so. All right, so you want to make sure you mix this in well because okay. we're not going to come back to mix it again. Okay. So I need to add a little bit of water. Then once we cover this, we'll let it steam and cook. Can we get it? Yeah, and some will work. Cut down. Yes. Okay. All right. Now that I've added my water, mm -hmm. it's now time to add the signature ingredient. You know, you're asking, what is this? What is the signature? Okay, so. so people keep it secret. What yeah. is the signature? Okay, tell so us, tell the us. Secret to this, my signature jollof, is my signature Maggi jollof seasoning yes. from Maggi. <laughs> hmm. So we're gonna add this. But it's salmon now. Oh, and that is the secret. Nene, come on, I was your okay, secret. Okay, okay, okay. So, 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 so,
Yeah, I'm take this off. Okay. So my signature jollof finisher for your jollof. Jollof will never be the same again. So how many use it? So we use two. You can okay. help me with the other one. Okay. So let me add this one first. So Chiga will help me with the other one. Signature jollof. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it once and then that will be it. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna do this on low heat. So we're good now. So let us cook okay. and then we'll go on to grill our chicken. My name is Kaza. Uh, yeah, it's like, okay. I, we already put our mic. She can jollof the chicken. No? <laughs> Jollof has a certain power. You can jollof yes, anything. Yes, you can jollof anything. <laughs> so let me get this into the oven. So. Okay. 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 So we're gonna let this grill. All right. So our chicken is in the oven, mm -hmm. and our jollof is here steaming. When we come back, we'll be ready to plate and eat. <laughs> So um, my signature jollof is ready. This is mm -hmm. ready. This is just the way. It's ready it now. Yeah, it's ready. Yay! Um, we're going to plate so we can go on for iftar. I mean, it's almost time for iftar. So you are key testing. So she's going to test. Let me bring my assistant. <laughs> Wait, she bring Ms. Assistant. Chokali. All right. So she's um, gonna tell my Kenny. Okay. On the testing level. Okay. Then. Then she will let you know also. Okay. So come and test and then tell us. Thank you, Hankali. If I can send Zafi, you can take one back here. All right. So Hmm. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> so let's go ahead and start. Oh my gosh! <laughs> on the plate now. Yes, on the plate. Wow. Cut this. So it's, she's waiting. Oh. She can't sit still. Speechless. English not there. Kai, 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 kai. This is so good. You are a cookie. You are a cookie. I am a cookie. I just learned a new one. You are a cookie. Obviously, Chigirl is enjoying this. I, I, we mm. had the token Lima to kitchen and cup. What else? <laughs> what else? Sit and full coverage, like insurance. <laughs> you are covered. Shoka! Lee! <laughs> Mashallah. Jazakallah for watching. Join us tomorrow, inshallah, for another interesting episode of Maggie Diaries. Remember to follow us on our social media pages at Maggie underscore Nigeria on Instagram and at Maggie Nigeria on Facebook. Assalamu alaikum. <laughs>